Hey, what's going on, Grilla fam? Dom here, as always, with Grilla Grills. Out at our back patio today, brought out the Kong, and I brought out our island. Now, that is going to be a fixed fixture back here. Fixed fixture? Eh, it'll work for me. So, we've got our silverback going low and slow right now at 220. Now, why do we have both the silverback and the Kong out today? Well, we're going to be doing something a little bit special. We have something that I like to call a pecana. A lot of other people out there call it the same thing. Uh, this is a top sirloin cat. So, the cool thing about this, it's one of those pieces of meat that comes fatty, but you're gonna leave all that fat on. This is gonna be one of the most simple steak recipes we have ever done. Salt, pepper, garlic, done. Throw it on the grill. We are gonna let the meat shine in this one because this is a fantastic cut of meat. Coming to us straight from our friends over at Colorado Craft Beef. So our steaks are just about finished on our silverback. Coming up to 120 is the point I want to take them off and then get them on our Kong. The Kong is just firing up now. Should be up to that six, 700 range before we know it. And at that point, we're going to take those steaks, flop them right here on the Kong next to our asparagus, and then we're going to rock them on here for about a minute, minute and a half each side. We're looking for a final temperature of 135 on these. That's going to be where I'm going to pull them off and see what we got. I'm so excited to get these on the grill because not only do we have our steak going on, we're going to have some asparagus lined up on the other side. We have our split diffuser in our calling today, a brand new item that you can go and get on our website right now. This gives you the ability to cook indirect heat on one side and direct heat on the other, which means we're going to be able to cook our vegetables, our asparagus on that left side and rock out our steak on the right side. All right, guys, it has been a fantastic day so far. I can't help but smile with food like this in front of me. We took a picana, what I say is the most underrated steak out there. Learned all about it from our friends over at Swine Life. He gave me the down low on how to cook this, and we showed you guys exactly how to do it. No seasonings on this other than salt, pepper, garlic. That is all you need on a beautiful buttery piece of meat like this. I'm not even gonna give it a try right now because I know how well this thing turned out. I'm gonna go bring it over to Mark and see if I can surprise him with a great day. Thanks so much for tuning in everybody. Please like, share, and subscribe this video and all the others. Share them out to your friends. And hey, if you got something that you think could make this a little bit better, go ahead and shoot it to us in the comments. Tell us about it in an email. Your recipe might be the next one we're cooking here in the backyard of Grilla Grills.